laughing and leaping over impossible hurdles. Once upon a time in the whimsical town of Jovialville, there lived a hilarious and determined individual named Max Max had a unique talent for finding humor in every situation and had a contagious laughter that could make even the grumpiest of people crack a smile. Max had a dream to become the world's greatest high jumper. There was just one problem, Max couldn't jump higher than a pancake. But with an unwavering spirit and a funny bone that never stopped tickling, Max was determined to overcome this seemingly impossible hurdle. Max decided to seek help from the renowned coach, Professor Chuckles. The professor was known for his unconventional training methods and his ability to turn any challenge into a laugh-inducing adventure. With a twinkle in his eye and a nose that honked when he laughed, Professor Chuckles took Max under his wing. Their training sessions were a riot of laughter and absurdity. Instead of traditional exercises, they played hopscotch on stilts, jumped over rubber chickens, and even attempted to leapfrog over an army of giggling clowns. Each training session became a side-splitting spectacle, with Max's infectious laughter filling the air. As time went on, Max's jumps began to improve, not because of physical prowess, but because of the sheer joy and laughter fueling each leap. The town of Jovialville gathered to witness Max's progress, not just to cheer for a high jumper, but to be swept away by the contagious power of laughter. On the day of the big high jump competition, Max stood before the bar, eyes sparkling with excitement. As Max took a deep breath, the audience held theirs, waiting in anticipation. With a running start and a leap that defied gravity, Max soared over the bar, leaving everyone in awe. But what amazed the crowd even more was the explosion of laughter that followed. Max's jump had triggered a chain reaction of hilarity, with the spectators unable to contain their mirth. The stadium echoed with roars of laughter as people rolled on the floor, clutching their bellies. Max had not only cleared the physical hurdle, but had triumphed over the impossible with an infectious sense of humor. The judges, wiping tears of joy from their eyes, awarded Max the highest score for not just the jump but for spreading the gift of laughter. From that day forward, Max became known as the Funny Flyer, inspiring others to embrace humor in the face of challenges. The world realized that sometimes, the key to conquering the impossible was not just in physical strength but in finding the funny side up. And so, Max's legacy continued to soar, reminding everyone that with laughter, even the highest hurdles could be overcome. The town of Jovialville forever cherished their funny flyer, whose laughter-filled leaps reminded them to approach life with humor, resilience, and a funny side up. Your support means the world to us. If you found value in this video, please give it a like and subscribe to our channel for more.